I'm not super counting down. I don't even know why I'm out here. I guess just because I'm supposed to be, because people say when it's nice to go outside. You haven't seen me in a while. That's because I haven't been like shit. Past 20 days, we didn't have any rain. And the pollen was killing me. Now we got rain the past few days, but it got cold. So, for some reason, my allergies were still bothering me, but also the the damp rain. I didn't expect the rain to be cold at the same time because it's June. But it did, and um, uh, mainly today, I uh, I woke up, and I felt all right, and then. The more as the day went on, I had a neck headache because of my stenosis, and uh, my left ear was all plugged because of my allergies. Still, kind of is. Now I understand why babies cry when they have earaches. I didn't cry or nothing, but my left ear is so hurts so bad. But finally, my neck loosened up and cracked. If I wake up. I'm do my thing and um, lay around a couple of hours and watch TV. I normally wake up at five or six for no reason. So I just chill out and watch TV for like two hours. I normally drink like uh, Diet Mountain Dew for caffeine. I don't, I'm not really a coffee drinker. It's died, Dr. Pepper. Anyways. All day. I had a neck. Horrible neck. Neck headache. And almost, I swear it was even a migraine. Um, when I laid on the couch for the first couple hours, I was alright. Just my allergies. Then when I got up and I, uh, I made cigarettes like I did with my machine and My neck, unbelievable, it wouldn't crack. Normally every day it'll, it'll, it'll go like this and it'll pop one time. I'm good for the rest of the day, it loosens up. And comes some pizza guy or something, not for me. Anyhow. Uh, all day, I put everything on my neck, I put Voltaren, I put this menthol stuff, I put Tiger Balm. Normally when it feels like cornflakes and I move it around, it's okay, which that's not even good. I even tried traction, uh, a traction therapy thing that you pump up and that might have popped the hair. But it's almost like a muscle, but it isn't. It's the two discs up in here. And I should get the surgery, but... I'm not, I can't, I just, not at this time, I, my mom had it and, I don't know, didn't seem to do much better, and I really don't want two metal screws in my neck, I already have a metal rod in my leg, but, uh, I feel better now, out of nowhere, um, I pushed myself, and uh, I didn't go nowhere today, which I didn't have to, but uh, earlier it was just miserable. It was damp and cold, and that's horrible for, like, stenosis and arthritis and stuff, and uh, surprisingly my back, my back didn't hurt, just the neck, and it, it feels like you got, like, a knot right in the back, and no matter what you do... It, it just so I laid I laid and I didn't even care what was on TV I was watching like a Drew Barrymore show or something and then 
I, I had the ice rice bag. My mom makes these rice bags that they, they're big and keep them in the freezer and they're rice and they're really like uh, spandexy and they just form around. They're big and they form. They form around wherever it hurts and I just laid on my pillow on the couch and um, it formed around that the left side of the, my neck and even by the ear that hurts and I'll tell you what after a little while it you know it, well it's, it doesn't stay cold forever but I popped it back in the freezer and, and I, I did my normal day stuff I didn't go nowhere but I didn't have to that's why sometimes I buy stuff ahead of time because I know there's going to be a day or two in a row that I just I can't function in between the neck and the ear I was messing with like my, my, my vision and my like I felt like dizzy like your equilibrium when your ears get all jacked up um you get wonky like uh i've had other people that you know when i go to the stores and stuff we talk just cashier and stuff and they say like oh they sinuses and this and that it's the worst pollen season and i'm glad the rain hopefully it makes my allergies better but because i'm outside and for days i was avoiding being outside specifically because of the yellow pollen and um as i can see there is none in my car because it rained for two days and um I'm supposed to get more rain but not tonight or tomorrow but not till well tomorrow but like tomorrow evening so that shouldn't bother me because i'll have tomorrow um the whole day to, to do stuff um i do want to get out and do stuff like um with my metal detector and whatnot i've already went and got everything i need extra nine volts and a little shovel and new gloves and i even asked if anybody wanted to go with me i said i split the difference if i find anything because gold's very valuable right now I haven't got a response. I don't care. More money for me. I want to go on a day I feel really well. Far and few. Um, in the mornings, I want to go to like, uh, like baseball fields, like hit around the bleachers and along the fence, dugouts, uh, playgrounds along gravel. Blue stuff um, somewhere at the park where they have things like uh, around the uh, stage stuff like that I'm not really gonna dig anything and I'm not gonna destroy anyone's property it's, I'm just gonna scrape along the top um, it's not like beaches and stuff where you can really go to like Florida but anyhow a little bit ago and that's why I'm out here uh, my neck finally cracked, and uh, oh, it's sunny and nice, and just right. Because earlier, I, I, I uh, made myself get up and do stuff like I checked the mail, and then I like, took the garbage out, I uh, watered my plants out front, and not to show that again, I got sunflowers growing finally. Um, and I came out and my whole car didn't have any pollen on it so that 303 works pretty well but I noticed inside of all my door jams there were there was pollen that's how much we had it got in my jams so that could be why even though there wasn't any on my car when I would leave I'd still get I'd come back sniffling sniffling and then just you know it gets it gets everywhere it gets I don't even know my windows because it'll just I'm not going to invite her in. It's like a damn vampire. If you invite her in, it won't leave. 
God. It's, it's a beautiful day, and I'm trying to take advantage of days like this. If I had felt like this earlier, I would have went and done some. But as you notice, like most videos, I always have a guitar. And I'm outside, though, so you might wonder, how are you outside with your favorite guitar, the Glary? And yeah, I got shades, but when I put these on, um, I look cool. Yeah, I look key. Eh? Kitty, it's my pet pet. Anyways, I got the Glary, and um, yeah, I got a little table I bought and a couple chairs out here. And... Glary's in tune. Volume up. the uh, little mini deluxe my fender 9 volt battery I lucked out and I got it on Amazon last year for like uh, 15 bucks and they're worth like 50 and for a little 9 volter it, it, it packs a punch I mean um, as you can see I'm sitting outside and I'm playing an electric guitar I usually just plug in my uh, cigar boxes. Got dust on it. It's, it's the same battery I put in almost a year ago. And um, it's still, well, you know, it has uh, volume, tone driving on and off. And um, see right here. And I bought something similar for my brother. I think it was a pile. And I got that on special for almost 15 bucks on Amazon. And it's worth about 50 it was one of the Amazon days things, and um, I bought this just mainly for when I was making guitars. So when I would put pickups in, I could tell when they worked or not. Instead of dragging a big amp out, I would plug the guitar into this, and then uh, I didn't even put strings in half the time. I would just take a drill. Right next to it, like Eddie Van Halen did on, um, oh, what the hell was the song? Um, Pound Cake. With Sammy. And, um, I don't have a drill outside of me, but you can... I'm still not quite feeling great. My back is hurting a little. Mainly for sitting on this chair. Uh, but having the arthritis and the stenosis and whatnot um, isn't fun. And um, I was bitching about my allergies with the pollen, and I wanted it to rain just one day to get the shit out of the trees and off my car. And it did. But it got cold, and that I didn't expect, because it had been in the 80s for like, hot for like 20 days with no rain, and like a drought type thing, and um, I didn't think, because I thought when it rained it wouldn't be like 
cold rain. Because it went down to the 40s and rained, and that's no friend with um, stenosis or arthritis. Um, but yeah, I'm, today I'm not a prisoner in my house. Uh, it's still fun. Uh, I want to get out and do shit, you know? But anyways, before I go, uh, glary like I, I show you, and um, pull this off for a second. I'm going to kind of set it down and not scrap anything on the cement. I'm wearing the ACDC back in black, and I'm wearing the Yankee. This thing is actually probably... Um, Got it in 2006 on eBay in a bidding war, and um, I won. And the camo, I guess it's like a support the troops type jersey. You don't see them too much anymore, but the camo Yankees, you see camo hats, but you don't see a lot of jerseys. Um, I don't really wear this. I'm, I used to wear it a lot, but now it's almost like. A collector's item. I have other, a ton of other Yankees and Giants here. Um, oh, there's the back. And then uh, today, as far as shoes go, these are one of my favorite pairs. The uh, the Prolox the Sony. And um, believe it or not, I got them they, my size. They're like ten and a half. Brand new. Brand freaking new. At Goodwill. For $4.99. Now I have a lot of high-end shoes. These aren't $4.99 at Dunham. Or online. These are closer to... Uh, about 100 probably. You know, if you're lucky. They might be less. But these are more of a... I wear them like all the time. Out of all my shoes, I wear these, and I really take care of them. Um, when I bought them, they had the knobbies still on them, and um, they had Dr. Scholl's inserts, but they had never been worn. The everything was clean. It was like someone bought them for to work out, and they never did. So I locked out four dollars and ninety nine cents. And I, out of all my shoes, I have so many nice shoes. And I tell you what, these are always my go-to because they're so comfortable. And um, but come summer when I'm wearing shorts and you know out like to the store and stuff, I'm gonna wear more like my Adidas and Vans and my Hey Dudes and stuff like that. So, but that's that for that. And um. I was just shooting the shit, and as you can tell by my demeanor, I'm not still 100% up the bar. But watch, tomorrow will be a big turnaround, and uh, with the change in the weather, I'll probably be able to get up and go, you know, at least for a little while. Um, that's that. Uh, Y'all have a good day, and I'll. Mm. Talk to y'all next time. Bye-bye.